Always fun. So we don't have to worry about food again, which means we're going to the squat. She's gonna guard. He's gonna scavenge. She's gonna sleep. Okay. And we need to take. I'm just gonna take the lockpick. That way it'll break down and I'll have um, more spaces in my backpack. So no really com no components really here. Um, we're gonna run through. Come on. And unlock this. We forgot to bring anything last time. Exactly. Well, good. Great minds think alike, right? So that's awesome. Let's see what's in here. Ooh, jewelry. A lady likes to find jewelry every now and again, right? There weren't any components, uh, but that's alright. So, drop everything back, pull everything together, see what we got. Definitely take this. Definitely take these. Um, I learned from last time, apparently we need water. I'm gonna take sugar for trade. I'm gonna take jewelry for trade. I'm gonna take a bullet. Um, just because we have guns now and we need them. Other than that, I think we're just going to do the wood for some building supplies, if anything, just to patch up the house and head back. Super easy. Easy peasy. Which means we're probably going to have to start uh, looking somewhere else because there aren't any components there. I was really surprised. Day 13. But you use components like crazy. Found plenty of really fine stuff. What a night. Awesome. Oh good. Night was calm. Happy dance. Woot woot. Okay. Odd number day. So just go to sleep. No eating. Temperature still holding. No problems there. Um. Oh. Did you not get to eat yesterday? Whoops. I forgot to feed the other two people yesterday, apparently. Hey, ghost, what's up, man? So they're very hungry now, which sucks, because people are going to be sad because their friends are very hungry. <sighs> Please make one of those. But they'll be alright. They'll be fine. Um, okay, they're fixing that. Those two are asleep. Transfers a whole stack of items from one place to the other. Huh, really? I'll have to try that. So now they're hungry. Here's Sveta's story. Um, with the start of the siege, the attendants fell as many parents chose to keep their kids home. When uh, one, yet, one young man advised me to cover the windows with mattresses from the gym. That's silly. Children need the light to read, I said. And besides, it's not like anyone is going to target the school. Boy, were you wrong. Um, hungry, content, tired. Here's something. Getting food is now a priority. Priority. We must persevere. Yeah, what do you have to say? I wish I could help my friends. They look so hungry. I know. I'm sorry. I forgot. I didn't realize that they hadn't eaten. That's a my bad right there. My bad. But you guys are fine now, right? We're all good. We need parts to upgrade that. Poo. Here's the trade guy. Maybe we can trade with him. Welcome back, hey hey. So now that we've boarded up the house, we can do a reinforced door. Um, we can think of reinforcing the door and installing a simple alarm system. That way, even if they're all sleeping, um, even if they're all sleeping, they can still fend them off. So, okay, the loves children trait. 
I think Mike looked it up for us. And, um, I'll, I'll look it up again, make sure I'm saying it right. When the kids come to ask for food from you, which is a side event, um, they, they take less food. Like, at first when they come, they ask for two things of meds. If you use the person that has the love children thing, they take less meds, I think is what it said. But I can check. Okay, good. So Hey Hey's thinking kind of the same thing that I'm thinking. I'm looking it up here. Yeah, she doesn't get depressed so easily, which is good. I'm not sure what the loves children means, but when speaking to begging children, they will ask for half as much as usual. One medicine or one food instead of two. Gains and losses for morale for actions involving children, such as the siblings who come begging for medicine. Um, okay, so she doesn't get quite as upset. Also observed a party-wide content moral buff when completing said quest. So, there you go. I'm glad I brought that trade stuff. Jeez. So we need food. If I could have all of that, I would be happy. But... It doesn't look like he's gonna let me have all of that. Hmm. That's actually right there. That's actually, um, well, that's enough for three people. So. Oh, duh. Sugar. It's like I completely forget about it or something. This offer is just too impressive. There, that's enough for everybody. Let's see if we can upgrade this. Please upgrade this. Please, please, please. Ah, not enough. I need ten more. Alright, let's try to get ten. I don't know what I'm going to trade in, but let's try to get ten. I just don't build the moonshine distiller first. I'd rather build stuff for food first. Hmm. I mean, I guess I can give them a saw blade since we can make them. Just start even some things out, I guess. Yay! Oh, here comes. 
comes the puppy dog with his toy. What's the matter, kid? Hi! Huh? Hi! Yeah? No, stay away from my mic. They don't want to talk to you. So we're making a hatchet, so that's good. We finally got a freaking hatchet. I'm really excited about that. Um... I know somebody's at the door, guys. Notice as soon as we got the hatchet, this stuff came up. So things that I didn't make, so I didn't spend any materials making them, I can break them down for materials, which is really cool. Is it good because you can trade with it, I guess? So see, got nine things of wood from that. Six things of fuel. This thing is a lifesaver, especially in the middle of winter. can also use it as a weapon. Um, hey James, what's up man? You can also use it as a weapon, but just be known, it's not a silent killer. It, it makes a lot of noise actually, so watch out for that. You can also take the hatchet with you, and when you do, you can um, break up furniture in the places that you scavenge as well, so I can break up desks and stuff in the church um, and get fuel that way. Oh, and yeah. Hey, Dr. Man, thanks for the follow. Woot woot, you are number 50. We are halfway to our goal, guys. I'm so excited. It's awesome. Thank you. Okay, so I like to take the fuel back when you take the hatchet out and you chop up furniture wherever you go to scavenge I like to take the fuel back instead of the wood because you can carry four fuel to a slot in a backpack and you can only carry two things of wood so if you really need fuel you might as well take your hatchet out and get it that way then bringing back a whole bunch of wood that just has to be turned into fuel so hooray yeah I know we're halfway there I'm really excited actually really excited right now guys make my day you guys are so awesome ah okay so what really stinks is you can't see your backpack because I forgot to look at my backpack before it went to nighttime but I do know well the school is not it is important to read this because there are different different things, like different things that can be going on in a single place depending on your walkthrough. Sometimes the school is safe, sometimes the school is not. It just, it just depends. Um, so make sure you read those. I know, we're halfway. That's really exciting. Uh, materials and weapons. Oh, man. Some weapons. church. There was quite a few things we can still scavenge there. Not food so much, but um, materials, but we don't need, we don't need food right now. I don't think, actually we might need another saw to be completely honest. Uh, we'll take that. I'm not sure we need it though. <laughs> You guys are funny. So that's everything we have in here so far. All good stuff, but I'm pretty sure we left a lot of stuff here in this hallway that I didn't pick up just because I was looking for food. So now we actually need it. So hey, don't sneak up on me like that, dude. I was like running. I don't I didn't sneak up on you. There's no sneakiness here. Pick up all the stuff, start running it back. Components, that's what we need. Components. Makes me happy. Hi, I have some things to exchange. Do you want to see? Not right now, dude. But maybe in a little bit. There it is. everything. Okay, you said right click. Oh! Oh! Who said this? Was this ghost that said this? 
So apparently guys, cool trick, if you right click instead of left click, the whole, all of it goes. Even that? Yes, all of it. The whole stack goes. That's really nice, actually. That's really nice. Okay, ten playthroughs, and I have, I didn't know that, so. This game is awesome. I don't think you'll ever, you'll ever learn everything about this game. It's insane. Pokemon theme, and then when I got those captures from there instead of the girl. Ah, that stinks. Yeah, it's really important to pay attention to the story because if those three scavengers are there the first time, I load in and then I run away. I don't even try to mess with them. Um, and then usually the next time you come back, they're gone. What are you doing? Don't do that. Hey, Tolka, what's up? Counter changed to 49 and changed. Counter changed. Counter is at 50 now, right? I think I can get up here. That's why I brought the saw. Yep. Look at that. Who is being smart today? This girl. Good thing I have a saw blade. Let's start cutting. It's almost like I knew we needed a saw blade. They're friendly? They're not friendly. Those three guys, they like really tried to hurt me. They shot at me when I tried to walk in to scavenge. Maybe I had something on me they didn't like. I don't know. So, James, you're telling me those three guys at the supermarket that show up instead of the girl and the soldier are friendly. I don't remember having that experience. Yeah, we saved her this playthrough as well. Um, earlier, it was a little while ago. Not too much up here, is there? We could chop that up for wooden fuel if we needed to. much got everything that we can. Everything we can take without stealing, so that's good. Hey, what are you looking for? What the poop? What the poop? What just happened? I have no idea what just happened. I looked away from the computer for like two seconds. What just happened? Why is he attacking people? They were friendly with me also, but I remember once they tried to shoot me. Yeah, with me, they tried to shoot me, so I don't ever consider it safe when they're there. When they are there. Um... That's worth quite a bit. That equals food, because we put it in traps. We need components. A lot of them. And those are for trade and to keep people happy. Run! I don't know what just happened or why somebody tried to hurt somebody else, but just run. Jeez. all this stuff. I wish I could bring so much every night. Well, good. Glad you're happy. Okay. Night was calm. Happy dance. Woot woot. Woot woot. Yeah, yeah. Makes me happy. Uh-oh. Oh, we have food. Okay. It's like, oh, I forgot. It's fine. We're good. What happened here? So, part of Pablo's story, it was tough, but women living in our street took great care to look beautiful. They were always clean and wore their best clothes. That was a sight, I tell you. Lining up for water, they looked as if they were waiting to visit a theater. And my boy came up with another idea. Oh, goodness. Boys and their ideas. I'm almost afraid to hear what he comes up with next. Okay. 
So it's an even day, um, and so everyone eats. Um, even day, everybody eats. Temperature really isn't dropping quickly or anything, so that's good. Everyone who was up last night gets to eat first, so that's these two. We aren't doing absolutely wonderful uh, with food, but we're making it. We're doing okay, I guess. Should be enough for both of us, don't worry. Huh. Well, maybe next time, instead of just, you know, panicking and running away like I'm pretty good about doing, maybe I should, um, maybe I should wait and hang out and see what happens. So I'm going to start the filter going so we can get more water. Um, I'm not sure exactly how much we need. How much do we have? We only have five. Make more water, please, because everybody needs to eat. And while he's there, he can use the hatchet and get some more stuff. Oh, and I do have medicine. Oh, hey. Alright, we're gonna use Sveta, because she loves children, and supposedly, they will only ask for half. Normally, they'd ask for two medications. Let's see if they only ask for one. Our mom is sick. Please help us. Nope. They still ask for two. So, I don't know. I don't know what she's good for. We live several blocks away from here. Our mom's very ill. She needs medications. Could you please spare any? Without your help, she will die. After daddy went to fight, we have only her. Please help save her. Please help us save her. Um, we're going to give them to her because we're nice. Thank you. Quickly, let's get the medicine to mom. Bam. Just like that. So now we don't have much to trade with. <laughs> Alright, we will still get stuff done. No worries, no worries. He can come down here. We can get some stuff built. Grab all of that. What do we want built first? Let's check here. Okay, we don't have enough for the door yet. The door is important. I do want to get on. Um, wow, that takes 30 things of wood. Goodness gracious. So, you come down here. Not here. Fix the helmet. Let's do that in case Sniper Junction becomes available. Yeah, so I used Sveta for the kids, and they still asked for two. They didn't ask for less, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure what's going on there. Okay, we have enough water. She can eat. We've repaired the helmet. Um, so I don't think we really need to upgrade. Well, I do want to upgrade this eventually because you can refill the empty shell casings to reuse them. Um, but I haven't had to do that upgrade um, in every playthrough. So it's not life and death necessary, it's just helpful. Meds are hard to come by, but we did the right thing. Well, good. Poor children, I hope our meds are enough to help their mother. 
Those kids are very brave. They risk their lives walking around the neighborhood to save their mother. And apparently it says she has more to say, but it hasn't loaded. So, what are we missing? Oh, radio. Have a nice night. Wish you good luck. Thanks, Tolga. Thanks for stopping in. We'll see you later. You can always watch the rest of it on YouTube, man. Oh, here we go. New weather. It's cool outside with clouds and possibly rainfall. Our advice for cold evenings is grab a good book and a hot cup of tea and relax in your armchair by the fire. Well, it'd be nice if everyone could do that, right? Due to recent shortages, the prices of cigarettes and tobacco have become exceedingly high, which we already knew that was coming. Uh, many people need cigarettes to calm down, but how can they be calm knowing how much they must pay for them? The rebel and government forces are engaged in violent skirmishes throughout the city. Some areas have been completely cut off while others witness heavy fighting. So we already kind of knew that too. I'm kind of waiting for that to clear up so we can access everything we need to access. Um, we need some filters. Make a couple filters because we're going to need a ton of water. When you have four people, oh my gosh, you can't have enough water. It's kind of ridiculous, to be completely honest. anything else in the trap here. We can get this going and then I think it'll be the end of the day. That please. They are all content except for Anton um, for doing that. I don't know if that's really a difference because of Sveta or not, so I'm not sure. I guess uh, we'll see how it goes um, as we continue with the kids. I feel like we left some stuff at the cottage. Let's go clean that up. We don't really have to have anything right this moment, so we'll just clean that up, get rid of it, get, you know, so we don't have to worry about going there anymore. Might as well. I mean, I don't think we really have to have anything right at this moment, so... Yeah, here's some stuff. I'm hoping it'll let us go back to the garage soon. Oh, yeah. Wow. More stuff than I remember. Um, three. We want those. We need those for the traps. We'll take that for trade. 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 And we'll use this for building stuff. 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, yeah. Okay, cool. So that wasn't too bad. We didn't get um, boxes of components, but... But I'm okay with what we got. Found plenty of really fine stuff. Good, good. Happy dance! Calm night. No one got sick. Yeah, 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 yeah. Happy. Be happy for the little things in life, right? Listen to the radio and then go to bed. Now we do kind of need to worry about food now. Um, because they need to eat tomorrow and we don't have enough food. Weather's the same. Cigarettes and tobacco, that's the same. So everything's the same. So everyone that was awake all night needs to go to bed. Let's see if we can make the door. Oh, hey, look, we caught some more food. Oh, thank goodness.